Good evening. In your tonight's business news, Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky intends to make an official state visit to South Africa in the coming months as part of his efforts to strengthen ties with African countries amidst an ongoing conflict with Russia. This was revealed by the Minister of International Relations and Cooperation, Naledi Pandom, last week during the department's election manifesto, citing that Zelensky expressed his desire to visit South Africa this year to create stronger trade connections and engage in discussions about the future relationship once the war is resolved. Panda also highlighted Ukraine's keen interest in agriculture and its potential role in enhancing African-led food security. Independent economist Stephen Mansu shares his sentiment. If it is for uh, the reason of economy or relationship based on business and the economy, it remains objective for South Africa, of course, because South Africa has titled itself as neutral to whatever which might be happening in other countries, including uh, Russia and uh, Ukraine, or including the war which is happening in Israel. So each and every president is allowed to visit South Africa as long as it remain a business and economical purpose. And you'll realize that the, according to the reason which were uh, titled by uh, the Ukraine uh, government, they've said that the government of Ukraine or the president of Ukraine is visiting to strengthen the relationship between South Africa and Ukraine, and secondly, to strengthen the economic ties between the two countries. What is important, you'll realize that South Africa has dependency of some sort on agricultural activities happening between South Africa and Ukraine. And if there are wars in uh, Ukraine as it's happening now, it is affecting the economic uh, prospects between South Africa and uh, Ukraine. So that becomes an objective way of resolving such matters. But if it is uh, uh, nothing to do with either politics or business, I mean, uh, economy or business, where it has to do with uh, the politics, that's where we will see a lot of problems going forward. So uh, the support uh, uh, which we have seen the Department of uh, uh, International Relations given to Ukraine to visit, visit South Africa, it shows that it has nothing to do with political, but that can boost the agricultural sector, can boost trade going forward after the war because we still really need this relationship as the country going forward after the wars.